channel once again my name remains pastor smart nachi the md nachi international farms limited today we are going to look at how to hatch snail eggs you know many people keep wondering how snail eggs could be hatched to produce more snails so this very recording will teach us precisely how best to hatch snail eggs. If you see in the cellophane uh, bag I'm holding, you see a lot of snail eggs. Although I would have brought out one or two to show you, but it is not ethical to touch these eggs with bare hands. So if I touch the eggs with my hands, they will not, that particular egg will not hatch. That is why I am showing you the eggs through the cellophane bag in my hand. We have so many eggs here, almost close to, let me not uh, give figure that is not correct, but this is above 60 eggs I have in this waterproof bag. And I'm going to prepare, this place is the hatchery, is the hatchery for this very farm. So I'm going to put these eggs in a condition where they will hatch. So as you watch me do that, I believe you are going to learn a lot from it. So this is the hatching like I've said before. When you want to hatch their eggs, there are two methods of doing that. But we are going to use the general one, which is what I'm about to do. You see this uh, hatchery farm is filled with a particular soil. The soil you find in this hatchery farm is what we call uh, sandy loamy soil. And uh, you cannot do snail farming or hard snail eggs without uh, the sandy loamy soil. You know, there are soils that are acidic in nature. Such soil is highly prohibited so long as snail farming is consigned. If you bring such soil into the farm, the snails would rather die than live, including the eggs. And also, there are soils that lack calcium. So such soil is also prohibited because snails need calcium to grow very well. So when you talk about snail farming, you will also need to talk about sandy loamy soil because that's the best soil one can use for snail farming. So the soil you see right in this farm is what we call sandy loamy soil. Now, to get these eggs ready for hatching, you watch me. Sir, it's okay. Watch me carefully. I am going to open the soil a little. As you see me do it, I'm not going to dig hole. I will open the soil a little to create space for the eggs like you see me do so having done that the next thing i will do is to spray these eggs right in that very little hole or space i have created on the soil this is exactly what i'm doing Maybe we should count to me exactly the number of eggs we have here. Yeah. Watch me closely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, 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 forty-four,
you just cover it with a little amount of soil like what I have done okay now you see I have buried the eggs so the next task I owe this eggs here is to make sure that this very ground is wet regularly once the floor is dried the eggs will start going bad so the soil must be wet it will carry high moisture to make to help the eggs to hatch so it will remain like this every day i will come to get this place very wet from time to time i will come again to get it wet until 28 to 30 days in the next 28 to 30 days you see these eggs buried here will hatch and the snails will creep out on their own and start creeping around freely so this is exactly how to hatch snail eggs having known this i want to believe you will be the next person that will start counting number of new eggs you produce yourself so this is one of it by the time we'll come back maybe after 28 to 30 days we'll come to check if these eggs that we have positioned here have all hatched and also we know how they look like when they are hatched newly so thank you as you watch we'll still give you a recording to show you more of this snail farm you know we started by showing you when this as uh, very place is under construction as i speak to you now it is almost completed completed 99 percent so i will be showing you a video I'll take you around the farm for you to know how it looks like so that in case you want to prepare your own, you know exactly you have a pure view of what to do in your own farm. So stay tuned. In case you have not subscribed to this channel, look below the screen as you watch. You will see a red button there. Just click on that red button and you subscribe to my channel. The benefit of that is that if you subscribe, subsequently as i bring up this uh, uh, tutorials this uh, video you have you have the opportunity to learn more of stuff like this so that when you are doing your own farming you will not run into error till that time god bless you real good